Greetings Goddess Natalie. I am the goddess known as Jackie Gates and this is my application to your contest. Your first question, how I see myself <laughs> and how I want others to perceive me online. It's sort of multifaceted because I didn't know the answer to that question. So I decided since I'm an actress, I would create a role and become it. And I just kept sampling titles and roles until I found one that fit. And I became a goddess. I'm a self-made goddess. <laughs> and that's how I want to perceive, be perceived online. I want to let other women know that they don't have to accept the labels that society puts on us. So many times we take them on without thinking. We um, get channeled into certain labels. We get channeled into being, um, sometimes even being a wife and a mother, you know, but most of the time that's our own choice. But we get, we get channeled into taking a job with a title. We get channeled into, um, you know, somebody will say, you're so clumsy, or, um, you know, you're, <laughs> you're very blonde, in a, in a not so good way, or, um, you know, you can't be a doctor, you can't do this, you can't do that. There are all these labels that we don't get a chance to choose for ourselves, and the ones that are given to us or applied to us throughout our lives, we accept as real. And I want to give women permission to choose their own labels. To choose that title that will be an inspiration, an empowerment, a goal, a statement of purpose. I had one young woman that I talked to who decided to become the Queen of Connecting. And in becoming the queen of connecting, she has brought her family together in more ways than she's ever been able to before, just by owning her new title. So that's my, my deal. Um, yes, I believe real friendships can be made online. My friends all live in my PC. <laughs> Not all of them, but I'm fairly much a homebody, but at the same time, I'm incredibly social. In my theatre life, um, I was on stage for many, many years, starring in roles and whatnot. I guarded my privacy um, quite carefully because, you know, um, as with anybody that gets well known, it's hard to separate out the real friends from the, the hangers-on um, or the people who just want to tell you you're lovely and all this kind of stuff. So um, I very much enjoy the the socializing on Facebook and the ability to step away when I need to. Um, my personality offline is pretty much what you see now. <laughs> In fact, I spent a long time toning it down because, you know, I'm not born and bred American, so I tend to come off as wildly eccentric anyway. I was eccentric in South Africa when I, where I was growing up, simply because of my acting, because of the way I am. Um, and I never had the courage to just be that. It was always um, something that I tried to squash and try to fit into the norm. And I am so not the norm. <laughs> so I am starting to relish um, being as extravagantly eccentric um, online as I am here. I use words that people don't use. I use phrases that people don't use. And I make myself stand out. Um, and basically I understand that most women don't want to stand out as much as I do um, or as far as I go but at the same time they want to own who they are and I believe that once you own who you are you can achieve anything really. How would I want to be painted? As a goddess, <laughs> of course. Hopefully with a spotlight and uh, looking totally luscious naturally. Um, if you have, if you want a picture, I can send you one, but I do have a couple of videos that show me at my glorious best, and uh, you could probably pick a still from that. Anyway, Darling Heart, I'm just thrilled to be part of this contest, whether I win or not, and thank you for creating this wonderful entity on, and for considering me.
to be one of the women on Facebook. I am utterly delighted. Have a glorious day, Goddess.